Good morning. Hey guys, guess what I have for you today? You know I'm always looking for companies that will give me product to give away to you for my blog. And I ran across Scrap and Tote Company and I emailed them and I said, hey, why don't you send me your product so I can give away this on my blog because it looks really cool and I'll do a video and show them how to use it. And they were like, okay. So, you know, it's all about having fun, giving away stuff, doing the whole nine yards. So this is a huge, can you see how big this is? I know my camera is not far enough back for this, but this is just a massive Cricut cartridge holder. And I really, really like it because I am the sloppiest person on the face of the planet. I'm not kidding you. If my husband was here, he would tell you it's true. I am so messy. I'm so creative, but I'm totally messy. So you can see you put the cartridges in here. It holds 36 cartridges, books, and templates. So um, I opened it up. I really liked it. First of all, it was pretty easy to use. It was pretty easy to fill up because you just pop this out, little button there, and then see it comes right out, and then it hooks right back in. I'm gonna try not to. I'm gonna try not to knock over my lights, showing you how to do this. And then you see you just push it and lock it back in, and you're good to go. It comes in with this pouch, which I really like, and it's got some little um, folder things you can put your information on. I'm not that organized, so to tell you the truth, I ain't going to use them. I ain't going to lie to you. I'm not that organized. They're just going in and that calling it good. Comes with little Velcro things. Okay, so here I have my cartridges. What I discovered about this, though, is that I like to slide my um, keypad in the back page of the cartridge because putting it in here without being in the back page was really difficult. So you can see there, you just slide it in and you're good to go. And then you go on to the next one. So here's what I did, and of course I don't have all my cartridges in there yet. So I'm gonna take the robot's cartridge and just kinda of show you real quick how to do it. Put the cartridge away. Okay, set the cartridge aside. Go to the last page of my book. You know I'm a big cricket whore now because working with Provocraft, I just love my cricket. You're gonna slide your book in there, just like that. You're going to slide the cartridge in there, and then you're going to close it, and you're done. So check it out. It holds 36 cartridges. And what I was thinking was, how cool would this be to use at a crop? Oh, and I put the little Velcro pieces on here because I felt like I wanted the extra security. Um, they came with this one. I, I'm pretty sure they come with all of them. I'm not sure. I'll have to look. But anyways, here's the coolest part. And then you shut it up, and you have a little briefcase of Cricut cartridges. But here's the cool thing. Guess what? They're like, I don't know, these are like 70 bucks or something. They're, they're really heavy duty and nice. Oh, and the coolest thing that I haven't done yet is I'm going to make a page to put inside here. Because check it out. You can put your page in here. Check that out. Pretty cool, right? Oh, and it says it'll hold your 12 by 12 cutting mat, too, which is really awesome. I assume it means right in here. I'm not really sure. Let me look. Oh, no, I bet you it's on the back side. But anyways, it'll hold your mat, too. So, today, if you go to my blog, www.blueeyeschool.blogspot.com, I'm going to give one of these away to you. So, go to my blog, check it out, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of it. I really, really like this. I'm going to check out where the cricket mat goes and put that on my blog. All right, well, I'll see you next time. Thank you, Scrap and Toe. You rock.